Yes, what's going on guys? I'm in the car, my friend Rob's Golf. You know Rob, who came to um, sneak on with me. He's a good friend of mine. Um, I'm in this car, I've got stuff here at the back. Um, my stuff is just in the boot. Anyway, we're on our way to Crep City. So, um, anybody that knows me or my car channel or whatever, know that I, I do Crep City forever. I'm gonna, actually, I'm gonna get my, um, I'm going to get all of my videos from my car channel. Bang them on this channel, actually, I think. Maybe, actually, I'm not going, we're going Crip City, we're set up. I'm not actually doing Crip City tomorrow because I gotta work to make sure I can go to Complex Con. Yes, Rob. Rob's just picking up some yeah, uh, yeah. shoes from. Potential grails in a bag. Yes. You can't open it because you think they might be fake. Oh. Uh, that's another one. So, anyway, um, we're on our way to uh, Shoreditch now to Crib City, Truman Brewery as always. Uh, we're gonna set up, I'm not there tomorrow, but um, Rob will be there tomorrow. So um, make sure you guys check out his story, even though by the time this video is edited, because I'm really lazy, it'd be done. But anyway, um, on our way to Truman Brewery in East London for Crib City, we're gonna set up, I'm not there tomorrow, but uh, my guys, including obviously Rob, will be there holding it down. I'm um, gonna sell my ship anyway. We just collected uh, some bits from his office at work, they had delivered. Uh, so the other half don't realize he's buying that many shoes. Luckily, she definitely is not Ooh, gonna be man, watching no. my videos. Luckily, she's definitely not gonna be watching my videos. Yeah. Uh, but anyway, so we're just going now. Rob's uh, driving, thank fuck, so I'm knackered. Um, but yeah, uh, what he did just say though, he's picked up a couple of pairs over the last uh, few days uh, for him and maybe just to bring Crip City and sell. But one thing he's always been after, which I fucking hate, is the Sean Weatherspoons. Um, so, uh, isn't that Rob? Yeah, Sean Weatherspoons, I've been following round two since day, um, before they were even the YouTube channel. So, since he wants to um, suck him off, he has always wanted these pair. Uh, I hate them, but he fucking loves them. And you know what? Anything I can do to help my friends, I've been on the lookout for a pair of these for him in his size because I think people say they're wrong big. Anyway, he's picked up a pair. We've just collected them when we got to Cripsy. We will open them. The sneaky suspicion though that the guy that he bought them off might have been pulling a fast one. So we will see when we get there if they are really a legit pair and he can get his grails finally or whether we need to look into that. So anyway, we're just on our way at Wimbledon. It's Crip City, should we? I do this for mommy, don't do this for money, your girls who are lovely. In my tracksuit or my tracksuit, man, a man feels so comfy. I grind all week. No, my grind ain't sleeping. Studio listening beats. Mummy needs peas. Some days, mummy don't eat. I'm finna grind for my dreams. Grind for my dreams. And see a jar breaking down buds, man. I never seen cheese so chunky. Plotting how we're gonna make a million, chilling and smoking on skunk weed. You don't need to grind like that. You don't wanna grind like that. Don't wanna spend time like that. Invest it, you can get your time right back. Get your time right back. Yeah. I'm out here 24, 7, 3, 6, 5 and a quarter. Two shams, man, and not a pauper. Hella yak, yeah, ain't drinking water, big yellow. Cool. Alright, cool. So we are at Truman Brewery. We just started to park up, or flow the shit, and there's a Mexican restaurant there. Uh, so we literally, that is the highlight of uh, Friday night setup. Um, to the left of the range, yeah? Nice yeah. one. Yeah, so I'm um, cool. Set up. Woo! Let's work it out. There's some Barbie and Ken shit. This is more than a friendship. I think that's what I meant to say. Yo, Alright, we're inside, we've arrived. That's Robin, our friend, and uh, he's, he's fucking bossy as fuck. All the stuff that he's brought is mad, it's literally sick. Um, wow, like, let me, let me just show you. From that pillar to that pillar. All his bags, look at all his bags. Like our bags are those, those three <coughs> and that one. But that's, that's just straight madness. It, like obviously I am a little out of the game now so I don't have much I didn't bring much with me because again I'm not here tomorrow but Robin just fucking smashed at me Jeez, it's fucking mad anyway let's have a look at Rob's um, anyway that's the rest of the city and the whole I'll do all around I mean, it's very quiet not very many people setting up yet I'm sure we'll get busier but 
Let's have a look at Rob's uh, wood spoons. Mm. All right, so moment of truth. I'm just going to open just... it now. I've bought these off of eBay. Um, I have a suspicion they might be fake. Um, the guy sent me out a pair, the tracking number couldn't be tracked, so he sent me out another pair straight away. Um, these are quite a rare shoe, so to have a couple of pairs just knocking about and send me out a pair next day seems a bit sus uh, suspect. Uh, especially as they're £380, I've paid for them, and he's lost them in the post, and he's oh, and it's fine, I'll just send another pair. So, um, so I, I've had a look online, I already know what I'm looking for. If the colour on the box says greenish yellow instead of lemon, uh, which is what the originals have, I know they're going to be fake straight away. Um, there's other telltale signs. Um, the uh, when you hold it up under UV light, certain things light up, etc. The stitching on the bottom of the um, insole, underneath the smiley face, is off. Um, there's little dots on the uh, lace aglets um, that pinch the lace together. The fakes don't have those dots. So there's a few telltale signs. So I just wanted to show that this box has come. Picked it up today from the seller. Uh, it's unopened, I haven't opened yeah, it yet. Open. So, so, you know, just in case they're fake, I'm going to be accused of all sorts. So, well, I'm well, now well, going to well, open well, this. Hold well on, let's put it down. Let's put it down here. And then let me also film with this. Yep, open it up. So, the box feels quite light, which is already a bit suspect. Here we go. Straight away, come on. It says beige, yellow, black, blackish green. So straight away I know that's not what the original box has got on. So I already know these aren't genuine, but we'll just open them up and have a look at some other telltale signs. The colouring's all off on that box here. That is way off. Um, the yellow's a lot lighter, the blue's a lot lighter on the original. Um, again, the colours in here, just off. Dust bag though. Ah, <clears throat> uh, uh, straight away you can tell from the colour. That green is way too light compared to the original colours uh, as well. The fakes have got um, multiple stitching on the back of the smiley face. This one actually has it, which is strange, but still, yeah, this is weird. Really and then the the other thing is the night is the laces. The lace bags have Nike on them, on the originals. These ones don't. And they're normally so they're really not, tightly... They're not genuine Nike laces either. So, uh, yeah, unfortunately, as much as the, Nike, the accessories are nice, everything about this shoe is fake, and I'll be contacting the seller to let them know. I'll be contacting the seller. The other interesting thing is, I bought a UK 9 and these are an 8.5. Um, so again, not as advertised. Yeah. So, um, these will be going back. It's a shame, but it's what happens these days. And that was that. So as you guys can see, as we suspected, the fake. Um, such a shame, but really he, he kind of knew. I uh, can't believe now. The hassle he's gonna have to go through. Hopefully, because he paid PayPal and eBay, they'll just be like, done. Um, this video that we shot, well, for here, but on my phone, it's enough proof, hopefully, just to say to send to PayPal. I might load that privately on YouTube so I can just send the link to PayPal. Anyway, um, just gonna set up quick. Not that much, because Rob has got loads and he's gonna do that in the morning. But the Mexican place that we always go to is kind of what we're looking forward to. Like I said, uh, we're gonna put a few of our pairs out, nothing much, just to select the tables. And that's it. Um, we tried to get away without paying for parking because normally you get 45 minutes we've been way over an hour so let's pay for parking let's go home and let rob sell my shit tomorrow because yeah i'm not gonna be here mm. see you later guys thanks for watching and guess what <gasps> he almost got scammed but he didn't sort of i think he'll get his money back we'll find out